Welcome to MLB The Show in this presentation of Minor League Baseball. Tonight, we've got a good matchup in store between the Jacksonville Jumbo Shrimp and the Pensacola Blue Wahoos. At the plate, Richard Starkey, and we are set for baseball here this evening. The one two is taken for ball two. Two balls, two strikes. And he fouls this one off. The two two one more time. Is laid off and the count runs full. Boy, not what you want coming out of the gate as a pitcher, right? You don't want to have to show all of your pitches this early on in the game, but that's a quality at bat. And what does it make you do as a pitcher? You have to use a lot of your pitches, and the more pitches a hitter sees, the better chance they have to make good contact. And it's one and two. Jax stands 6 2 and throws from the right side. He was selected in the third round back in the 2016 first year player draft. Hey, this guy hasn't reached the big leagues yet, but he's coming. We're going to know his name at some point. He just got a few more developmental things to work on. And it's fouled away. And that's high for a ball. It's two and two. Interesting sequence of pitches right there. A real ugly swing on a ball away, and it looks like the batter has a much better idea of what he's looking for. And the throw to first is there. The inning is over. Digging in, Joe Cronin. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Lays off the slider that time. Two and one. Wanted to go after the slider, but he holds off. Three and one. Having a little trouble finding the zone to start the night. It's always deflating to walk the leadoff guy in the game, so we'll see if he can initiate some contact here. Right side, but it's going to be a foul ball. Hit in the air to right field. Right fielder giving chase, but he won't get to it. And this should put a man in scoring position to start the inning. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. Batting second, the center fielder. Back kill. Back two. Into the box now, Akil Badu. Swing and a little blooper to center. In comes the center fielder. He tracks it down as the runner will challenge his arm and head for third. And he'll get into third here on the flyout, so he's 90 feet away here with one gone. The first baseman. Striding into the box, Todd McCain. First trip to the plate for him in this one, and it's a good RBI spot, too. Leadoff man at third with one down. And he comes back with a gorgeous slider there for strike two. Weak rounder back to the mound. And there's out number two. For the plate now is the designated hitter, Royce Lewis. In eight at bats in the series, he's collected three hits. The 1 1. Men on third with two down. One ball, two strikes. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Ferrar Encarnacion. Comes into this one with just one hit in nine tries for the series. Now a fastball swung on and missed, and it's full three and two. He was able to sneak that fastball by him on three and one. So, so now we've got a battle on our hands. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. That is it. No score here as we play inning number two. Two. 
too high, and that cost him ball four. Now at the plate, Bryson Brigman, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Bryson Brigman. Throw over to the bag. The one two misses ball two. Bird stands at first with one out. Ball. Trying to nibble here and he misses to run it full now. Three and two. Got to believe that runner from first is going to be in motion, especially in this situation. As an offensive player, just hit something hard because those defenders are going to be moving. He takes strike three called on the fastball. Couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. Now at the plate, Connor Scott. He did his part yesterday afternoon as he cashed in with three hits in a losing effort. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. Pitch misses low. The throw down. Short hop, but he's out. Great play to pick the throw and slap the tag on him to end the inning. Riding in, Ben Rortvet, as they'll have five, six, and seven here to start the home half of the second. The 1-1 one, one. is a fastball taken high for a ball. Two balls, one strike. Slider misses, and he's in danger of losing him here, three and one. Well, that sets up a big pitch right here, Matt, because you don't want to lose the leadoff guy in a scoreless game. It's tough to work around the leadoff walk. And a base hit, so the leadoff man is aboard. That is good. The right field. Gray. Cabin. Stepping in now, Trey Cabbage lifted the other way down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. The one two misses for the second ball. A runner at first with no outs here. Just a bit high with the fastball, but didn't get the call. And, whoa, awfully close, but it's ball four, according to Woody Keller. Coming to the plate now, Jose Miranda. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. A bouncer up the middle. Fielded cleanly. The second for one. On to first to complete the double play. Into the box now. Wander Javier. They off for him yesterday, but back out there for this one. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Sometimes it can be difficult for a pitcher. You're facing a guy that's not known to be a big stick in the lineup. Sometimes the toughest thing is to be aggressive and throw strikes. He's got it. Throw in time, and the side is retired. In now, Connor Scott, as we are all set to begin the third inning in this one. The 1-1 one, one home. It's the outside corner for the second strike. Play as well. One, two. Off the plate that time and a little high. It's even at two and two. Now the pitch. That's lifted the other way out to left. Contreras is underneath this one. One down. Stepping into the box, Santiago Chavez he comes in after a day of rest yesterday, so we'll see if it did him any good. Changeup called a strike, and he comes back even at two and two. 
Might have been taking all the way right there. That pitch couldn't have split the strike zone any better. And you can bet he wants that one back at the plate. The 2 2 one more time. It is looked at and the count moves full. Third inning, no score to this point. Softly hit toward the hole. Scooped up. Throw in time at first for route number two. Now batting, Nolan Oliger. He's two for seven in the series so far. Oliger. The 1 1 home. Is a fastball down below the knees. Strike taken up in the zone. Here now the 2 2. And he goes and chops this one out towards second. He'll whip this one to first in time, and that ends the inning. Now in the box, Mark Contreras, as we move on to the bottom of inning number three. He's set. Here's the 2 2. Oh, and they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. No Trying to pick things seven. up where he left Second off, baseman. Joe Cronin. It was a double for him in his first turn at the plate. And he's got to build off that last A.B. He battled. Usually when you battle, you get in that swing mode. A lot of pitches, you'll swing at the rosin bag. I love the fact that he was able to work a double in last at bat. Let's see if we get more of the same right here. Now batting. Digging in for his second at bat, Akil Badu. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. And with his speed, he's one of those rare guys who you'd actually like to see keep the ball on the ground. You can't beat out a fly ball in this game. He's got to hurry. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. So coming to the plate, Richard Starkey. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, but it was a good changeup, Matty. Good arm action on that pitch. Look for him to try and stay back a little bit more. Let the ball get a little deeper. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to rush a heater right here. And he lays off there, ball four. So the leadoff man is on here to begin stanza number four. Now batter. Into the box, Justin Twine looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at-bat. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there, north of seven, eight pitch A-Bs, sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. At the plate, J.J. Blade And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. Not a good spot to be in right now. Pitch has fallen behind in a count with a guy up that hits really well with runners in scoring position. Full count now, three and two. Line drive to left. But coming on quickly is the left fielder to make the play for the first down. So here's the cleanup hitter, Ferrar Encarnacion. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. A swing, and he pops him up on the infield. And the infield fly rule will be in effect here. Next will be the designated hitter, Corey Bird. Reached base via the walk in his first plate appearance. Bird. Right there at the belt. One and two now. Wow, I can't believe the hitter took that one. The pitcher absolutely got away with a hanger. Line towards center field. That's in there. Base hit. Long throw to the plate. Oh, but it's offline, so the run will score. Now batting. The first Bryson Brigman. Into the box. Bryson Brigman. Mm. And that's on the outside corner, one and two. Ball two. Playing two balls, two strikes. Here's the two and two. 
swing and a little blooper to center. Javier onto the grass. He gets there to make the play, and that ends the inning. So digging in now, Todd McCain. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Down low, two balls and a strike. This guy's been really on point so far, but it's not getting any easier. He has to get through four, five, and six right here. Well above the letters with the fastball that time. Great A.B. up until this point. A walk right here could really just infuse some confidence into this lineup. Three and two. Well executed fastball right at the knees. Going to be a long day for this offense if he stays in that spot. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Left fielder giving chase. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. Striding forward now oh, is the D.H., Lewis. Royce Lewis. Lewis. And he lays off the pitch down and away. Ball two. A little too tall that time. Three and one now. That fastball really got away from him there. That's kind of a red flag for me that he's starting to tire or wear down a little bit. The first thing that goes is location and then your mechanics. We'll see if this continues. Now batting. The pitcher. Ben Rortvet. At the plate now, Ben Rortvet. Yanked high and deep down the line in right. And it's a foul ball. Runners on first with one down. Now a throw over, and he'll get back in safely. Here he comes again, one, two. Got him swinging. Chased it well out of the zone, and there are two gone. Now that is. At the plate, Trey Cabbage. He's picked up four base hits in the series on six tries, so he seems to be really locked in now. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Well, it looked like the fastball got away from him there. Out in front as this is pulled foul into the seats. A runner on first with two away. Hopped up. Brigman calls for it, and that ends the inning. Stepping up now, Connor Scott comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Now the 2 1 pitch. Up the middle, and oh, he's able to knock it down. He's safe. A great recovery, but he couldn't get it there in time. Now batter, the catcher, Santiago. To plate now, Santiago Chavez. Up high, 2 and 1 now. Grounded back up the middle. That's through for a base hit, and he's one for two now. And now he has some trouble with it in center. Now batting the first baseman, Nolan Oliger. So now to the plate, Nolan Oliger. Ball two. And this ball runs away for ball two, two and one. to two and two now threw that fastball right by him he had no chance to get the barrel of that one Ball. tried to bury one down and away but it's a full count now three and two wow talk about a waste pitch on two and two that one wasn't even close 
I don't know anyone that would have swung at that pitch. Only play is going to be the first, so score it as an RBI ground out as the lead moves to two to nothing now. Now batting. The so the batting order turns over Thank now you. and set to go Richard Starkey. Starkey. Fly ball in the line in left. Left fielder is on the move, but he can't get there. It's over his head. He pulls into second safely as a run will score on the play as well. Now that second base. Justin Twine. Into the box now. Justin Twine. Slow little roller to third. Reined in. And that's the second out. Digging in once again. J.J. Blade. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. This is line to left. And that finds the outfield grass for a base hit. As he arrives at second without a play, as also on the play, a run comes across to score. Joey Crable, a six foot two inch right hander, jogs in to take over on the mound. Your attention, please. for the Blue Wahoos. Number Stepping in now, Ferrar Encarnacion. Fastball swung on and grounded out towards second. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Leading off the inning, Jose Miranda, and they'll need him to get something going here. This one doesn't look good so far. Down by a boatload as we enter the middle innings. It's about time they get something going. And the last thing you want to do is fall behind where you have to score a bunch in the eighth and ninth inning. Here's the one and two. Shin high. That's taken for a ball. And they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. Now back. So striding forward now, stop. Wander Javier. Javier. Now the one and one pitch misses no. off the plate. Bases are empty, one man out. Takes this the other way to right. And that's a base hit. One for two in his first couple of plate appearances. The left fielder, number 10. Mark Contreras. Standing in now, Mark Contreras. Swing and a liner. And that gets down and ought to be good for extra bases. And now it'll kick around in the corner. Javier rounds third and is digging for the plate. And he's safe at the plate as they now trail by only three. Vincenzo Aiello will take the ball now as the new pitcher. The batter, number seven, second baseman, Joe Cronin. In now, Joe Cronin. Smoked on the ground left side. And that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm, a base hit. And now he has some trouble with it in left. To second now, but he's safe. As a run also comes in to score, making it a two-run ball game. At the plate now, Akil Badu. Line to the right side. And that's in there, base hit. And they won't risk it at third, so they're at the corners now with only one away. McCain. So now to the plate, Todd McCain. This is hit softly to third, but gloved by the third baseman for the out. Ready once again, Royce now Lewis. Back. And we'll see what he can do here. Two on, two away, two home so far this inning. The 1 1 home is taken for strike two. Runners at the corners, two men out. And the slider runs away from him there, and the count levels at two and two. Oh, right back to him on the mound. And he'll flip it onto first, and with it, that ends the inning.
Top half of the sixth about to get started. Digging in and looking for more, Corey Bird. He came through with an RBI single in his last at-bat. Yeah, guys, everyone knows he's been slumping. Dan, you can certainly attest to this, only amassing a solid one hit in your entire career. But pressure's off now. Maybe he gets hot. Fastball, and hmm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's 3-1. and one. And just when you needed a shutdown inning, a leadoff walk was certainly not on the agenda. He needs a bear down right here. He's set. Here's the three and two. Hit out towards second. Fielded cleanly. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. The bat. Now at the plate, Bryson Brigman. 0 for 2 for him to this point. Brigman. Out of the stretch, the 3 2 pitch home. Fastball, strike three called as he couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. Settling in now, Connor Scott. He's one for two in the ballgame. Here's the 3 2. Now a swing and a fly ball. And it's a foul ball. We're in the sixth inning now of a 4 to 2 ballgame. High and deep to right center. A ball that's carrying. And he makes a nice catch on the track as that ends the inning. Bottom of the sixth inning now. Coming to the plate now, Ben Rortvet. He went down on strikes last time up. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this A.B. Count is one and two now. Now the pitch. And a fastball swung on and missed as they set him down for the second time here tonight. Now batting. Stepping up to the plate, Trey Cabbage. He's 0 for 1 thus far. He takes strike three called on the fastball. Couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. Stepping into the box, Jose Miranda. One and two now. Trying to strike out the side. Here it is. Two out, nobody on. Fastball didn't miss by much, and it's a full count now. Three and two. Wonder Javier would be next. And whoa, awfully close, but it's ball four, according to Woody Keller. Stepping in, Wander Javier. A hit in two tries for him so far. Here's a look over to first, and he'll dive back in. Now the one and one pitch. Two out with the man at first. Hit hard on the ground to second. That's through for a base hit. His second of the ball game. The left fielder, number 10. Into the box now, Mark Contreras. All three. Three and two, full count. Two down, runners at first and second. Hard hit to the left side, but taken in out there at short. Almost big trouble there, but he'll wind up stranding two as the side is retired. Randy LeBlanc is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 44. Seventh inning ready to roll. So striding in, Santiago Chavez. A hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ballgame. 
hit out towards second. And there's a base hit, so maybe some insurance here to lead off the seventh. Now back, the first base, Nolan. Into the box, Nolan Oliger. Sent on the ground out to second. To second for one. On to first, and they get them both. So the lineup flips over and digging in. Richard Starkey. He doubled earlier in the game. One for two to this point. The one-two. Breaking ball swung on in the dirt. Rortvet goes to get it. And the throw to first ends the inning. C.J. Carter gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seventh. D.J. Digging in, Joe Cronin. He's two for three and looking for more here. Even though we're moving into the back end of this game, they're only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slogan, a bloop and a blast? They could certainly use that right now. And there's one down now. Now with the plate, Akil Badu. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. The 1-1 home. He is swung on and missed, and that's strike two. Fastball. Whoa, look out. That just about got him in the coconut. Well, that'll wake everyone up. Anytime you buzz the tower like that, there's reason for people to start getting a little bit edgy. Bounce to first. He's right there, and he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Ready now, Todd McCain. The one-two. And he'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. And this misses, so that'll fill the count at three and two. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. The three, two, one more time. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. And indeed it will. He throws him out at first, and the side is retired. New inning set to get underway. Stepping in, Justin Twine. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Towards second. And this will be put away easily for the out. At the plate, J.J. Blade. He's working on a one for three thus far. Here's the one and one delivery. There's a curve ball, but it misses well out of the zone. One strike. Into the corner and slicing foul. The 2-2. Two -two. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Now another 2-2. Two -two. Getting late, 4-2 okay. our score as we play the eighth inning. Pitch popped up. And there's the second out as he squeezes it while standing on the mound. Now so back. stepping in, Ferrar Encarnacion. Herrera. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. The 3-1. And this one misses high for ball four, and they have themselves a two-out base runner. Now back. Now to the plate, Corey Bird. He enters this at bat, one for two with a walk. A ball and two strikes. Hey, from a pitcher's standpoint, sometimes the greatest pitch is the slider that backs up. He got away with that one, but he wants that thing to bury down the way. Now a move over to first. A runner on first with two away. Breaking ball that time that misses out of the zone. 
Good job to lay off that one-two breaking ball. Put himself right back in this at bat. Lifted down the line in left. Long run for the left fielder. And they can't run it down. Working for the punch out and the offering. Fouled away. Close there, but he doesn't get the call with the breaking ball. 3-2, two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. Skied down the left field line. And that will end up a foul ball. Once again, a 3-2. Late on that one as it's fouled off to the left side. Another payoff pitch. Here's a swing and a high pop-up. Miranda has a play. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. Alex Messia is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 96, Alex. So now it'll be the four-hole hitter, Royce Lewis. He was a ground-out victim last time up. Yeah, I understand that, Matty, but this guy's got burner wheels down the first baseline. I don't think he even concerns himself with that. He has to put it on the ground. That's part of what makes him successful. The 2-1 home. Back up the middle. And a reach to his backhand, but he can't come up with it, and the leadoff man's aboard. Not bad. To the plate now, Ben Rootbeck. And they come inside with the fastball, but it misses here, and it's back to two and two. Throw over to first, and he's back easily. The two two. And this is in the air down the left field line and into foul territory. But this will land untouched. Nobody out, runner on first. And another foul ball. The 2-2 two -two one more time. There's a swing and a miss. That's strike three. Standing in, Trey Cabbage. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. From the belt, the pitch. And he comes back with a fastball. 1 and 2 now. Tried to shoot the corner and he missed it. 2 and 2. Hey, he threw that pitch with a purpose to get a double play. Good job to let it go by, though, as a hitter. Oh, and ouch, that one drilled him. Safe at first. A good effort to recover there, and he almost made the play, but that's a base hit. In now, Jose Miranda. And he pumps the fastball by him here. One and two now. Good thing he didn't make contact with that pitch. Only thing he could do is probably hit that on the ground. It could be a double play ball. Now a fastball awfully close, but he doesn't get the call. It's two and two now. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. Wonder Javier will be his first assignment here as he'll face him with runners at first and second and two away. The 2-1 home. It's a swinging strike. Two balls, two strikes. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. Ryan Mason enters from the pen to start the ninth inning as he'll try to keep the score right where it is heading to the bottom of the ninth. All set for the start of the inning. Riding in once again, Bryson Brigman. He got called out on strikes his last time through. Yeah, Matty, and hopefully he got it out of his system. Especially now, he's got to bear down. He gets the two strikes in this spot, has to put the ball in play. 
that's the exact spot to lean on as a reliever. As a hitter, you just have to tip your cap and look for the next one. Struck him out. Struck him out again, I should say. His third punch out of the game. The 2-2. Two -two. Ball three. Three and two now. You see a right-handed batter waiting next, but he could very well be pulled back as the situation dictates. And, whoa, awfully close, but it's ball four, according to Woody Keller. Into the box now, Santiago Chavez. It was a single for him in his last at-bat. A 1-1 home. Takes a pitch for strike number two. Mason, a 25-year-old, he throws a four-seam fastball, a curve, a changeup, and a two-seam fastball. Swing and a miss on the breaking pitch. Two away. Digging in, Nolan Oliver. The first baseman, Nolan Oliver. The one-two. Gets him looking up around the letters. Tyler Kohler is the man called on to close this one and earn a save in the ninth. Number 54, Tyler Digging in to try it again. Mark Contreras. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. He's set. Here's the 2-2. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. He's around first, heading for two. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. No matter. That is seven. Second baseman. Go. Cronin. Stepping in now, Joe Cronin. Sliced hard on the ground, and that's through into right field for a base hit. Now that the center fielder, Akil. Standing in now, Akil Badu. And he lays off this one down and in for ball two. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. Couldn't be a whole lot better situation to hit it now. Three and one, two on. He's got to be thinking he's going to get a pitch he can drive right here. Count full, three balls and two strikes. Now the three and two pitch. Here's a line drive into center field. It's a base hit. Scoring is the runner from third, and that'll cut the lead down to one. At the plate now, Todd McKean shows bunt as he gets this one down. And the off-balance throw gets him. Nice play for the out. Standing in, Royce Lewis, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. Down the first baseline, but a foul ball. One and two the count now. Ready now, two strike pitch on its way. has been the at-bat of the night so far. Here comes the payoff pitch. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. Now he goes up to get this one as he pops it up over toward the right side of the infield. Oliger is under it. Two gone. Alex Mateo takes over on the mound now as he'll try to get the final out of the ball game here and pick up a save. Ben Rortbeck will be his first assignment as he steps in with two men in scoring position now, but also two away. One and two now as that one's fouled off.
one and two. Here it is. Two big outs here, but the tie and winning runs are both out there. And that one never threatened the zone. It's gone full now to three and two. Trey Cabbage would be next. And he misses ball four. So he comes out of the bullpen and immediately walks the first man he faces. So a big moment in the ball game here. Trey Cabbage. And the game is on the line. The tying and winning runs on base with two gone in the bottom of the ninth. Ball two. Fastball. Close, but he didn't get it. Two and one. It often becomes harder to hit the zone when the pressure starts to heat up. Good pitch as this is swung on and missed, and now they're down to perhaps their final strike of the evening. Lined to the right side, and he will deliver one of the biggest at-bats of the night. It's a base hit. One run is scored, and they're going to walk off here with a 5-4 win. Man, that has to hurt. But in the other clubhouse, it's got to feel awfully good. They battled on every pitch, every at bat. They found a way to scratch three runs across to win it. Impressive, to say the least. the lineup was clicking for him in this contest and the man you see there was a major contributor for that he's the top player of the game yeah he doubled down on doubles here two of them on the stat sheet and they were a factor of the outcome of this ball game This evening's game comes to an end 5-4 the final tally. Pensacola used a three-run ninth to help propel them to the win. Ryan Mason gets the win in relief his second of the year. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter at MLB The Show. Fans are quite a line score. First for the victorious Blue Wahoos. Five runs on 14 hits. One error. They left nine men on base. For the Jumbo Shrimp, four runs, seven hits. One error. They left six men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 15 minutes. Thank you for joining us here tonight. And we remind you to please drive